guys, this is Mike the Truck Bandit. We're at the 2017 Mid-America, coming back again this year with the Tom West from I Love Dump Trucks, the Quicksilver. Here at St. Matt's, St. Mid-America Truck Show, 2017 in Louisville, Kentucky. All right, what do we got today? We're so at, what we're we at got the Mack trailer booth. So. Here's what we got here. Got a frame type steel half round Mack end dump trailer with a half inch Quicksilver liner, 10 foot wide steel hold down plate for hauling asphalt just like we talked about put that plate on there so she doesn't want to flip up at the rear and this baby is going out to new york to go to work this year <clears throat> if you've seen some of the other videos he did the, he did the hold down plate like in the flat flat end up in this round i haven't seen it like that that's you know, it's, like that. it's not too often that you'll see it where you got it in a round. But what happens is that sometimes, like we talked about, even in a square end of trailer, that liner wants to flip up at the rear unless you have some kind of stiffener on it. That steel plate, remember, 10 gauge steel plate. This one here is weld washer through the liner to the plate, but you can also self tap screw it with a countersinking and it helps it lay flat. Even in a round, this baby's going to lay flat. What does that mean? You don't get material underneath the liner, but also you keep it wearing away at the very edge when it's flipped up. Why would why would Mac make this trailer with a round bottom instead of like the, the square bottoms traditionally? You know, it, I know it's kind of a simple, but maybe you know some of the viewers don't know. Or well, so sometimes in a half round like this, what happens is, is you know you can gain a little bit more uh, weight loss by going round as opposed to square. But some guys like it for better clean out. So by having a round, you don't have the corners where stuff wants to wedge or pack into the corners. The other thing that's really nice, and we saw this happen out in Kansas City, a fleet out there that had some steel half round trailers. We did the Quicksilver in those. There was a ready mix plant where they were taking five and foot long chunks of concrete off the ground, throw it into the trailer, take it back to the reclaim site, grind it up and make more concrete with that material. Well, what would happen was, they would throw it into the trailer and it would just hit and slide. Whereas a square, it would hit and wedge. So it oh, actually oh. took the impact better in a round than in a square. Oh, I got you, I got you. I got you. All right, well, this is Mike the Truck Man and I'm with the Tom West and we'll see you at the next booth at Mid-America 2017. Thank you.